Panchatantra and epic that lasts till 200 BC. The one who follows this epic certainly leads a great life. Panchatantra was originally written by Vishnu Sharma but some say that it was written by Vasubhaga. This epic was translated in more than 100 languages across the whole world. Panchatantra evolves around the five tantras. Mitra Beda that means loss of friends. Mitra Labha that means gain of friends. Surut Beda that means causing discord between two friends. Vigraha that means separation. Sandhi that means reunion. This epic teaches all kind of human values to all kind of persons around the world. So as we have learned what is Panchatantra, let me take two stories from it. Once upon a time there were two frogs who were husband and wife. One day the lake in which they were living started to dry up in the summer. So they began to move. They started to search where they could stay afterwards and they saw a well full of water. The female frog was about to jump, then the male frog said stop. The male frog said, what if this well dries up, how could we get up again, how could we come out again? For this female frog also said, yes, how could we come? So from then on, the two frogs left that well and begin to search a new place. Here we find a moral that don't jump into a situation without thinking twice. I will present you another story. There was a king in a small kingdom. One day a big army attacked it. The king fought very well but unfortunately he lost. He ran away into a cave where he hid there. He was in a depression and he was very sad that he lost a war and his kingdom. One day he looked at a spider web. The spider tried to build a web but it failed every time. It tried, tried, tried but it failed. At last it succeeded in completing the web. The king saw it and from there on he got an idea and he got a motivation that trying, trying, trying until you get a success. There are so many short stories in a Panchatantra where there are so many different kinds of morals which helps us to lead a great life.